Guyana and the rest of the Caribbean are being encouraged to look into the establishment of medical hospitals catering for tourists who need medical attention. According to the chairman of the Caribbean Tourism Organization, Beverly Nicholson Doty, medical tourism has been identified as the new market in waiting to be explored in attracting visitors to the region. But while Ghana may just be contemplating the future of any kind of tourism, other countries in the region have been cashing in. I think that there are other components that certainly have incredible um, opportunity for the region that we are looking at. Medical tourism is certainly one um, that that has the, there's, there's a lot of opportunity. One of the areas, and you know, it was in New York just a few weeks ago, that we really are seeing uh, interest are in is those investors that are now interested in working in the Caribbean and how do we um, have that as a component of the experience and that has dual benefit for us because while they vacation in the region, we certainly hope that they will also take the opportunity to invest in the region. Secretary General of the Caribbean Tourism Organization, CTO U. Riley, reminded that one of the aims of the CTO is to position the Caribbean as the number one choice destination for vacation. He said now some member countries have recognized the need to go beyond the traditional products such as sun, sea and sand. We've created and we're discussing during the course of Caribbean Week the, the concept of total visitor satisfaction. And not surprisingly, there's a very strong connection between the vision of the CTO, which is to position the Caribbean as the most desirable year-round warm weather destination up to a particular period by 2017. Uh, there's, there's a complete nexus between desirability and visitor satisfaction. Just recently, the Jamaican government announced that a five-star 200-bed hospital will be constructed at an eventual cost of $200 U.S. million. Capital News, Leroy Adolphus.